Hey there, welcome to this episode. We're going to take a look at the menu options. So we're going to go over to menu or use this little icon on our touch screen. Here we can see all of our menu items. Now with the NPC, there are a lot of these. You'll notice we even have two pages worth. You can scroll over and you can go to another page. So just keep in mind these little arrows. They're not so easy to notice at first, but they are there to allow you to navigate between the pages. This is where you're going to find all of the modes. Now, depending on your NPC, you may have dedicated buttons on the hardware that are going to take you to some of these modes. It will vary depending on the NPC, but generally from this touchscreen, you can access everything you need. Things like your pad mixers, your channel mixers, Q-Link edits, everything that you're going to want to play around with is going to be right here inside of this menu option. The other thing that I want to show you is that on your home screen, you maintain this little sidebar. So if we go back to main, you will notice the little shortcut sidebar is there. If we open this up and we go back to menu, you can select whatever you like for that sidebar. You do that by just dragging and dropping. So let's say I wanted to swap out something like my channel mixer at the bottom for the arrangement view. I could drag this and just put it in place and swap that out. And now when I'm on my main page, of course, I can still see that custom shortcut. It's very handy. It's a really good way of, again, customizing the NPC to suit yourself, the things that you need the most, and they're just going to be right at hand. See you guys in the next episode.